let's get started here. Uh, a yeah. lot of clown news. That's the bad news. So I wanted to avoid the clown thing after yesterday's clown rant. I felt like I exercised the evil clown, got it out of my system. And then I started going through all my little small town newspapers around Minnesota and Wisconsin. It's clown this and clown that. It was unavoidable. These were all headlines ripped from small town newspapers in the last couple of days. City of Wisconsin Rapids, a local resident called police and asked to speak to an officer about clown activity in Wisconsin. <laughs> That's it? That was it. All right, just wanted to be sure. Maybe they were feeling a little left out. In city of, in the city of Owatonna. O-Town. O-Town. Police charged a 20-year-old man who earlier in the week was found running through an alleyway with a clown mask and a kitchen knife. The man originally told officers he was just out for a run, but later told them that, yeah, he had been attacked several nights earlier by a group of clowns and brought the 8-inch kitchen knife and his own clown mask to retaliate should he encounter any more clowns roaming the streets in Old Town. Uh, he was attacked by a group of clowns. So he went vigilante clown. Did they, like, tickle him? <laughs> what did they do? I- I thought at first the kitchen knife was like a butter knife. like <laughs> <laughs> Slapped him with one of those big shoes. <laughs> City of Montrose. Oh, my God. We're right over there. A clown dressed in camo and carrying a hammer was spotted near the Ugly Bar. Oh. <laughs> the Ugly Bar is awesome. It might just work awesome. at the Ugly Bar, yeah. Yeah, uh, just another patron. Yeah, that's probably year-round you can find a clown walking towards the Ugly Bar. You bet. Here's one from Glencoe. A 15-year-old boy reported a clown was in his backyard and then came to his door and rang the bell. Responding officers determined it was the boy's grandmother dropping off a birthday card. Just a lot of makeup? (laughs) Use the spatula to put that stuff on? Well, if she stopped over at night, you know, there's a shadow out there. Grandma's shadow could look like an evil clown. Oh, sure. City of Litchfield police responded to a report of three clowns on 4th Street squirting mustard on vehicles. Those sons of bitches. Now that's really bad. Uh, Wasting mustard like that? Well, the paint. Yeah. I mean, it'll stain your shirt for life. Imagine what it'll do to car paint. Here's one from Baraboo, Wisconsin. A police captain from Baraboo, home of the Circus World and International Clown Hall of Fame. Of course. Who revealed, didn't know that? I didn't, they've got the big uh, billboard out there. <laughs> revealed that there have not been any creepy clown settings in his city. According to the captain, there are no laws preventing people from dressing like clowns in Baraboo. We have a lot of folks in jail if that were the case. This is from the city of Sartell. A 7th grade student representing herself as a clown allegedly sent messages to six classmates. The messages from the clown included statements like, Do you want to play? And if you see a red balloon, just know I was there. Police took the 12-year-old girl into custody after she admitted sending the messages as a joke. Yeah, now she'll get waterboarded with the squirty clown flower. They get a full t- confession out of her. They took her to jail? Well, death penalty. 12-year-old, what was she sending again? She was sending texts. If you see a red balloon, know I was there. Do you want to play? We used to scare people uh, all the time. Yeah. Well, I, Terry, we don't know when the statute of limitations on these have run out, so I wouldn't confess to anything clown-related. Oh, we used to window peek. <laughs> that saw actually, a naked I, man once. That is actually against the law, Terry. <laughs> I know That's peeping. Is. I know it is. Unless he enjoyed it. <laughs> uh, he didn't know. He was like 87. He wasn't standing there in the picture bay window. No, it was... Uh, full Monty. It was. We were not meant to see that. 